The Mass Properties tool within SOLIDWORKS allows you to not only look at the mass of a part once you apply a material or once you apply a mass to either your part or assembly, but also allows you to look at the center of mass, the axes of inertia and principal moments of inertia, as well as the volume and the surface area. Currently this is displaying in metric units. If I want to switch that over, I can go to the options. In this case, since my document is set up in inches, it'll switch all those over to the English system. One of the things I often see SOLIDWORKS users do is try to apply a material to a stock part to try to get it to fit into the mass that they've weighed their part at or the mass that it's supposed to be. Rather than doing that, you can very simply go in and choose Assigned Mass Properties. And I can change the weight. For example, if this was 10 pounds, you can also come in and set up your center of gravity as well. And you'll see whenever you go back into the mass properties, it'll show those assigned mass properties. And you can simply click to switch back to the default mass properties. If you make any changes, you can also choose to recalculate and it'll repopulate the mass and all of the other data as well.